helps us all understand what we're supposed to do and how we're supposed to uh, conduct ourselves as a Metro Waste Authority employee. When I first started working, I, when I would go to the different facilities, it seemed like when I went to the landfill, for instance, four different people wanted to give me tours because they seemed very proud to work there and they wanted to show you what they do every day and how this has an effect on the agency and how the agency has an effect on the community. And it was really cool to hear their perspectives of how like maybe some little thing they did that day is having a bigger impact on um, everything as a whole that's going on. I mean, the way people treat people, the way they, they work together, um, I'll go back to an instance from this past winter where most of the time it was a job for utility workers. We had operators joining together, we had even management was helping out to get this task done because it was difficult from the snow and ice and it kind of brought everyone together to, to help get it done. Teamwork, especially the teamwork. Uh, so it used to be it was more um, individualized, I guess. Hey, my duty is this. Your job is to do this. Um, and really it wasn't, you know, who, before it was like, okay, it's your responsibility, it's my responsibility, it's a lot, lot, lot of you and I uh, talk, right? Now, um, I think people talk about we a lot. So. It comes down to accountability. Now we're all kind of on the same, uh, have the same standards to live by. And so when you're dealing with other, whether they're your peers, your boss, your staff, whoever it is, you know what to expect and you're hoping they expect the same from you, holding you accountable as much as you're holding them accountable. So I think that's made it just a little easier for all of us to, to work together. I, I think I've seen that open up some where people are more willing to share ideas and you know, be, be active because we're all held accountable to those values.